What's up, YouTube? This is the Billy Bob HD bringing you another Let's Play. Today, I've got some more EU4 Third Rome. We're playing as Custom Nation Dalmatia here in the Balkans. Let's keep it going. Uh, we're still making 1.8 ducats per tick here, which is good. I've turned down the army maintenance a little bit, and we're looking towards heading in on Bosnia, if at all possible. We're waiting for some favors to go ahead and save up there with Hungary. And uh, as I was looking, we only have three. So we get uh, a favor every two years. So in another 14 years or so, we'd be able to go to war unless I wanted to give them some territory. So we could give them the capital here, for example. Uh, Venice's opinion of Dalmatia changed by plus 30. Interesting. Because they were hostile towards us earlier. Yes, they were. Yes, they were. So... Uh, bum, 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 bum. Here we are. Off our alliance, negative 78. So still quite a ways away from being able to have an alliance with Venice, for example. Oh, no, infertile. Uh, the good news is we already have the air to start off the game. So as long as this guy doesn't die, we should be okay. Take a quick look at our technology now, and you can see... Sitting at that yellow mark, the Ottomans down here at a 544. I'm fours across the board. So I need to get desperately up to that five level mark to keep up or to show as a leader. Take a look at the great powers now. We have 49. Let's see. Total of, yeah, yeah. Total of 49 here going towards great power score. So quite a ways away from being able to achieve that. But we're going to work on it. Still at 11 force limit here for my infantry. Boats. We need to start building boats here pretty soon. We did just put in our first church at the capital here. We've got a fort level 2 going there as well. Let's check out some building stuff. Yeah, it may be worth it. Uh to get churches here and here, or we could just uh, invest in some development, for example. Um, Serbia, now with a spy network going. The capital, obviously, would give us the biggest bang for our buck. Yes, it would. Hmm. Let's invest one into that. We're going to go up to a 1.94 there in total income. And then Venice has since surpassed us in overall trade power. So we do need to bring up the Navy a little bit. So I think we're going to forego a building here and start putting it into light ship construction. Let's get a round of three of those in. So that'll double my Navy size. And I forgot with the new updates that I just got, I finally just... Uh, Invested in the rest of the DLCs here for this game. Nice, we can do the men at arms now. Or should we go for the longbow, which has that uh, offensive shock? Offensive morale, offensive shock. Let's go Galileo here this campaign. Uh, gained a little bit of inflation and some extra admin power. We do need that because we fell slightly behind in admin tech. So I'm showing as a bright green here, tied with the Ottomans and the French. So give me one more here. Give me one more. National ideas coming up, right? Which I think we may invest into quantity ideas or colonial stuff. Uh, here we go. National ideas done. Let's take a look. I'm thinking uh, hmm. exploration. Might be a good one to get. Quantity ideas, though. That's always good. National manpower modifier plus 50%. When does my next national idea pop out? Level 7. Yeah, I don't care about the Bosnian opinion, so we'll take that. So I tell you what. Let's go ahead and get the exploration ideas in. I want to be a leader in overall colonialization, if possible. All right, cool. So, uh, 
not you, but you. This is going to be the rally point here. Let's combine these ships in. Tell this Navy to come on home really quickly. And protect Ragusa. There we go. Represents a small loss, but we got to retain control of our current trade power. And here we go. Hungary. Requesting that we come to their aid in the Hungarian conquest of Vyoski against Bosnia. So their capital there. This is a war they have started. Of course we're going to accept here. Alright. Go down to speed three. For the fighting and such. Uh... Hungary has already moved into their territory. So let's go ahead and send these guys in. Immediately. The fort is up, isn't it? Yep. Alright, let's go. So a little earlier than I was thinking this would sort of pop off. I was sort of thinking I would be the uh, culprit in uh, bringing up this war. We lost... Uh, huh, already lost one ship there. We're just going to have him sort of sit at home just to retain that navy. The Serbian fleet came in against us there. We now control that. Um, should we move back home? To try to recharge the morale here? You can see we're uh, sort of missing. Nice. Let's move into the capital. Yeah, the, the Hungarians are already there, so we'll help out with the siege, obviously. And in fact, they're going to come in up here, so let's move our stack down. Here and try to take Trevenia. We're at a 15% war score so far. They're trying to blockade me a little bit. We do need to go ahead and replace this one here. We now control that one. Good deal. Let's move into Serbia. We're going to siege this down and then try to take out their three stack that they're rebuilding ne right next to us. Let's go. Excellent. Let's go and try to take out their army. Moving on in. Probably take a negative crossing. Yeah, we did. But we outnumbered them so badly. There we go. That's a win. Let's see if we can stack wipe them. Good numbers there for sure. Okay, sweet. So we'll just go ahead and uh, Kosovo there. Continue sieging that down. Still good manpower. In fact, let's get a couple more ships in the queue here. We now control their province here. Move up to Raska. It's taking them a while to uh, siege down the Bosnian capital. Obviously. Should be constructing a ship here. Gain one stability, heck yeah. I will take that. Wonder if that helps my income. Yes, it does. Move in here. Wipe out that cav. Easy win. Obviously. No mission has been selected. Create a proper fleet. Let's take that one, since we are working on the naval stuff. Still have the claim on Bosnia there. We now control that province. Looks like they're done for. So, let's move these guys back home. Try to minimize the attrition if we can. Making moves, making moves. Let's go to speed four, too, because... Yeah. Um, I'm not going to peace out early because Hungary is the most powerful ally that I have. I don't want to piss them off too bad. 
Ottoman army moving down south there. New boat's about to come out. Okay, there it is. So we're going to have a truce, obviously, so we're not going to be able to take Bosnia uh, immediately. They now owe us 17 favors, so let's make good use of them. Alright, cool. I'm going to immediately take the forts back down. Still showing at a plus 1.21 there. Venice operating with much more trade power there than me. Well, let's put the fleets back out and see if that'll help us protect trade Ragusa. All right, nice. Yep, that puts me back above Venice there at a 14%. Hungary, tied with Hungary at 14% as well. 50 admin power, heck yeah. taking a little bit of an institution's um, penalty right now, but we can, the good news is, actually embrace it right now. Let's go ahead and do that. So, good. The Ren uh, Renaissance done. Oh no, there goes my first king. We have an immediate heir at 030. That's not the best ever. Best news ever. Royal marriage from Hulu, absolutely. The queen, obviously, is strong as hell. So good for her. Uh, might need to bring this fleet back here, actually. There we go. New uh, ship coming out here. There we are. Protect trade, Ragusa. Cool. Lose 60 ducats. National unrest or five legitimacy? I'll take the legitimacy. When does this truce end? January 1474. So like 12 years before we can go in on Bosnia again there. Hungary got a couple of different provinces. Two cav, nine infantries here. Ahead of time in tech, for sure. Lose 50 admin power. Or diplo power. Hmm. So uh, about the same either here. It's just like, what do you feel like losing? I'm going to take the diplo power hit because I do want to put some development in. 56 there. This is the most bang for my buck here. And here. So putting in for some additional developments. Which increases my income by like 0.3. So if I take down the army maintenance here even further, looking good. Um, still have the one guy here. He is improving. Okay, so he is on auto, so that's good. Good, 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 good. Milan. Hungary. Both say no. Bosnia off on its own pretty much here now. As well as Serbia. So scary stuff for Serbia there, for sure. Making 2.69 ducats per tick. Alright. Is it time to check in on Austria again? Yeah, negative 17 there. Negative 25 there. Genoa wanted uh, military access. No thanks. Alliances. Poland would take an alliance. Hold on a second. Who are your uh, rivals? So Hungary is an enemy, but not necessarily a rival. I do think it's a good move to take an alliance with them while we can. Even if it pisses off Hungary. Perfect. Let's, uh... 
yeah, he's going to sit there. So, and then my Diplo automatically goes over to Poland there to improve the relations. So, good. That was a big move for us. Three out of four overall relations. Was still, uh, we're still poised with Austria there to potentially get some more territory, if at all possible. Ferrara here, allied with Savoy. Uh, Papal States. France, Castile, Luca, so some big time. And then Aragon here, Naples, Liberty, Desire. Only 26%. Not that bad. All right, Venice declared war on Naxos there. What are the Ottomans doing? Aragon and Tunis. Interesting. We can actually invest in a new idea here. So since we're ahead of time in tech, maybe we do take the uh, colonist while we can. Native policy. We're going to do um, native assimilation. Global, I'm going to take this one for the global settler increase. Nor heresy. Clergy loses 10 loyalty. That's a lot of bad stuff there. I'm just going to crack down on it. So. How much longer until I can get my explorers and such? Quest for the New World. Overseas expansion. Yeah. We need 380 in order to be able to do that. Current inflation is not that bad. So we're looking okay. Still all Catholic. Naxos coming in and occupying some of Venice there. Holy shit. Uh, church? No? What am I making on trade? 1.15. 14%. We could invest in another market. Put it in the capital of Dalmatia there. Ottomans coming in at 8%. 15% for me. 18% for Hungary. Just because of the number of provinces they own. That's what I'm guessing. Do they have another... Hmm. They're totally landlocked, right? Yeah. I was say, they must have a lot of trade power going up in these areas. State of Bosnia. Review my edict here. Uh, advancement effort. Protect trade. State maintenance of 200%. Nice. The Arbicus, done. We can now build barracks, too, which is going to be important as we get closer to Tech 7 for admin and get towards the quantity ideas. How much longer on this truce again? 74. Oh, God. What's this? Poland. Against Hungary. Hungary's allied with Austria. We're actually going to decline this. Take the prestige hit. We lose Poland. But I can't afford to uh, go in against them. Here at this point. So hopefully uh, with Austria on their side. They're going to win that. Negative 32, so things are actually getting worse there with the Austrians from a diplomatic standpoint. It's kind of bad. Milan needs some love, don't, don't they? Gain general with 100 tradition. Ah, I already have a general, plus I'm down low on prestige already. Let's take the legitimacy there, modifier. 
and let's uh, send our last diplomat over here. So getting a little bit closer now on uh, the truce being over with Bosnia. Lose 60 ducats. No thanks. Let's uh, start bringing up additional ships. Okay, good. Milan is maxed out there. And, uh, yeah. We cannot have... We actually cannot have a royal marriage with them, so... They're still a republic. At least they're Catholic, though. Back over here. Let's get that workshop in. Nice. Okay. National decisions. National tax modifier, missionary strength. We'll take that just for the cash. 2.45. I want to see if that jumps up to 2.49. And my claim. I don't know if my claim still is out there. It is. I wouldn't really need help from the allies here at this point. Hmm, Poland making some moves there against Hungary. And Venice apparently is... Okay, I was about to say they were losing this war, but they're actually doing okay. <clears throat> Austrian army was beaten up there. They've got another 22 stack trying to come in. Interesting stuff. Alright, new fleet is available. Take you guys in like this. Let's see what we can do about... Oh, God. Milan. Genoa is allied with Luca. I'm going to accept just to keep the alliance, but... Oh, we've got a... Um turn off the embargo out here. Okay. So what's a profitable mission I can send you guys out on? Oh my god, I built the wrong kind of ship here. I built the galleys. I should have built the uh, light ships. Yeah. We'll send for a doctor. Get rid of that maintenance. This is what I wanted. Yeah, this gives me a nice um, opinion with Hungary there, so let's take that. New idea, so we can finally get the Explorer. Or take it. Just so I can start exploring the world here. Um, so negative 5% there on Diplotech. Running a little bit behind. But still green overall. Lose one stab or one corruption. I'll take the corruption. Yeah, still showing as a nice technologically advanced country here at this point. And I'm guessing the heir lived through all of that. Yes, he did. 14 years old. Really good Diplo guy. That's uh, getting ready to come in. Okay, what's happening here? Trade income has gone down a bit. Fifteen percent, eighteen percent, and seven percent. So I may try to pirate. I think this is going to be our exploration fleet here with two ships. Okay, cool. I'm actually going to turn off the fort. 
Okay, we need a explorer. He's pretty good. Explore. Oh, three lights. Oh, God. Bohemian Conquest of Bohemia. Defensive War. The war with Poland is already going. So Bohemia trying to take chunks out of Hungary now. Anhalt, Hesse, Pomerania. I will accept. Goodness gracious. Light and heavy ships in the fleet to be able to explore with it. Okay. So I guess my fort's back on then, my castle. Where can I help out? I could go post up in this fort up here. Let's make our move let's make a move up that way. Oh, they've jumped over the border now. Let's stay close. Stay close, my friends. Uh, let's actually go to the capital. How's the war with Poland going? Not so well. Babbling buffoon. Diplomatic reputation minus one. So my son is a babbling buffoon. Nice. And we just got stomped here. Get out. Lost that battle. Military access from Poland. Don't think so. Did I just get stack wiped? Wow. I really did. I won a naval battle at least. Got 2,000 more men coming in. Loan offer from Saxony. No thanks. We're doing all right. I have no army, so... Yeah, he's trying to siege me down now, isn't he? So hopefully these uh, Hungarian troops will... free me of this um, siege possibility here, but... Oh, this one's from the Gen Genoese War here. So that's why they can't do anything. All right, let's get you a leader, the old shitty general there, and uh, let's also build another guy here. I've got full manpower, so that's good news. He's f oh man, hungry having to fight rebels over here while getting sort of stomped across its country here. Here comes a Hungarian army down this way. He's going to try to take out this Hessian army up here. Do it. Very good. Okay, Austria's still the emperor at this point. Cool. Well, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Again, this has been the Billy Bob HD. Please remember to like, subscribe, and or comment if you've enjoyed my content. And we'll catch you guys next time.